Hello, friends. The video will show you how to do the calibration for SK501 syringe palm. At first, please look at the panel. 10, 20, 15. That means for SK501 syringe palm, it can only recognize three kinds of the syringe. 10, 20, 15. Suppose if you use the 13, it can't be recognized by this syringe palm. Okay, let's start the calibration. Step one, you should mirror the lens for this three kind of the syringe from the big to the small one. 15, mirror the lens. There's a ruler on the side of the syringe. Mirror the lens from zero to 15, it rate 75. So you record the value on the paper. Then 20, from zero to 20, it rates 70, 70. Millimeter. The last one, 10. From 0 to 10, it rates 15.6 millimeter. The next step is start the syringe. In start syringe. Hold the lever, pour out the whole lever. In start the syringe. Here, press the button to move the compression instruct. Make sure the piston to the end of the syringe and keep the air in the end. Then and then with your one finger, press the clear button. Another, press the power button. Release all of your, your finger after, press the, after pressing about uh, five seconds. One, two, three, four. Here, input the value you read just now. 17.5. Knob to the left to save the value. Here, the 15 milliliter indicator nut is on. That means you have finished the calibration for 15 millimeter syringe correctly. And then, power off. Twenty. Actually, the calibration steps is similar to the 15 millimeter. It start. Press the button to move the compression struct. Keep the no air in the end. Here, one finger press Bolo's button. Another, the power button. Release all of your finger after pressing about five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. So, input the value you read just now. 70. Press the seventh value. Here, the 20 indicator net is on. That means you have finished the calibration for 20 millimeter syringe correctly. The same power off. The next one 10 syringe. The same install the syringe. Press the button to move the piston to the end. Keep the no air in the end of the syringe. Here, one finger press stop button, another press power button. One, 
two, three, four. Release your finger. So input the value. Fifteen, six. Fifteen, six. Press the knob to the left to set the value. Here, the indicator is on. That means you have finished the calibration for 10 milliliter syringe correctly. Then, remove the syringe. Power off. That's all. Thank you.